Hey everyone, it's Jack Curry with Intentional Walk. Everyone knows Derek Jeter was the last captain of the New York Yankees. In fact, general manager Brian Cashman has said he thinks Jeter should be the final captain the Yankees ever have. Now I'm here to talk about Aaron Judge. I'm not saying the Yankees should automatically name him captain. That's their decision. But what I do want to talk about is how a couple of days ago, when he was discussing the Houston Astros and their cheating ways, Judge acted like a leader. He acted like a captain. In a civil, firm, and eloquent way, he answered questions about the Astros, how that impacted the Yankees, how it impacted baseball. And if you were a Yankee teammate listening to Judge, you looked up at that TV or that monitor or wherever you saw him and you said, I want that guy to lead me. Because Judge talked about how the Astros had potentially deprived the Yankees of getting to a World Series, something every player is starved to get to. He said he thought that their 2017 title was meaningless. But you know what else Judge did? He brought up kids, fans, who look up to players as role models and even superheroes. And what does a parent tell the kid who says, hey mom, hey dad, why did the Houston Astros cheat? So when Aaron Judge spoke that day, it reminded me of Derek Cheater. And if the Yankees ever did want to name Aaron Judge captain, I'm sure Yankee fans would be elated. But I do also want to add some perspective. When Jeter became the Yankee captain, or was named Yankee captain, he was in his eighth full season, and he already had four World Series rings. So I'm sure even Judge would say he has a ways to go to try and catch up to those accomplishments by Jeter. Our song of the day today, we're going with Casey Chambers. She's an Australian singer. She's got a song. Guess what it's called? It's called The Captain. Go find it.